here on our Saturday morning here at Bassett Park. Now you've heard that we're about to watch and we'll crown some champions with some great Bob Berg Designs buckles up for grabs for our champion of the junior youth and senior youth here today. Also we're having DJ Entertainment over the bar tonight on Saturday night. Also the dinner as well brought to us by the Baking Asylum. I'll update you what you that will be on the menu here this evening from the Baking Asylum. It all lies glued on a Jade Lion Spins Silver Ray Volver, owned by the Lions family. About to cross the showtime line here today. Some of our up and coming talent that we're about to watch. Our junior in senior youth here today. Placed in the junior youth at the Tarum Cutting Show at the start of April. Let's watch Jade Lyons spins Silver Ray Volva. Thank you very much there, Jade. That was Jade Lyons from Rockhampton. Number one on the draw, that was Spin Silver Ray Volver, owned by the Lyons family, side by Ray Jewell out of a Spins a Silver pistol. I got the wiggles in my knees when she looked at me and sweet and smiled. 68-point marking there for Jade. 68. Next up will be Kate Smith, and then we'll have Rachel Brown, then Mitchell Stave, then James Busfield. Also go and check out Iron Philly Custom Leather from Gundawindi, Queensland for original custom leather carving and handmade cow horse tack. Phoebe's got a trading stall set up. Go and check out her amazing goods that are handmade. So head on over. As we move to Kate Smith, number two on the draw. This is Bohemia Rock, owned by Terry and Caroline Elliott, our chinchilla. Signed by a one more Jesse out of Bar S Bohemia Rose was bred by Terry Elliott.
Thank you very much there, Kate. That was Kate Smith. That was Bohemia Rock, owned by Terry and Caroline Elliott. That one's side by one more Jesse out of a bar S Bohemia Rose. Well, nice job there for Kate. 73 there for Kate today. 73 point marking. She's part of our senior youth division in our youth herd here today. So she'll be leading the pack right there. As next up's going to move to is Rachel Brown, and then we have Mitchell Stave, then James Busfield, then Molly Hart Dog, Tog. Is our next, there will be our next four. Thank you very much to RAS Contracting, Earth Moving Trucking and Agriculture, www.rascontracting.com.au. Well, let's move to Rachel Brown from Thebine, number three on the draw. This is I'm a Neat Cat, owned by Jamie Brown. Side by I'm a Smooth Blue Cat, out of a Neat Kitty Corner, was bred by Leanne Haywood. One of our competitors in the senior youth that we see place each and every weekend. And her weekend shows. An NCHA Australia finalist as well. Let's watch Rachel Brown, I'm a Neat Cat. Thank you very much there, Rachel. That was Rachel Brown from Thebine. Number three on the draw, that was I'm a Neat Cat, owned by Jamie Brown, side by I'm a Smooth Blue Cat out of a Neat Kitty Corner. Well, nice job for Rachel. She's going to go to number one. 75-point marking there for Rachel today, 75. That'll be our new leader in the senior youth. So we'll now move to Mitchell Stave, and then we have James Busfield and Molly Hartog. And then Boston Musgrave. Thank you very much to Crawfo's Tyres, Dunlock Super Dealer and Century Batteries, corner of Warrigo Highway and Charles Street. So we get set for Mitchell Stave from Colston Lakes. Number four on the draw, this is Saloon Dancer. Owned by Mitchell Stave. Side by Smarty's High Card out of a Mrs. Doubtfire. It was bred by the Parawina Pastoral. So next one to go. Mitchell did a great job last week in North Star. So let's watch the young man, Mitchell Stabe, with Saloon Dancer.
Thank you very much there, Mitchell. That was Mitchell Stave from Colston Lakes. That was Saloon Dancer owned by Mitchell Stave. They were signed by Smarty's High Card out of a Mrs. Doubt Fire. Well, that's going to put you in number one spot in the junior youth, Mitchell. 69 points there for Mitchell today. 69. Nice job, Mitchell. Next up will be James Busfield. Then we'll have Molly Hartog. And then we'll have Boston Musgrave. Then Amy Lou Pot. That'll be our next four to go in this event. Thank you very much to Brown and Hurley Agriculture, Mounts Machinery, Think Machinery, Think Mounts, dealers of Case and New Holland, www.brownandhurley.com.au. Let's watch young James Busfield. Number five on the draw, Crimson Cat, owned by Jill Busfield. Signed by Tap Dance and Cat, out of a Spins Jewel, was bred by the Seven, seven Star Quarter Horse Company. He's part of the Senior Youth Division, so we got 75 and 73 in the Senior Youth, so... Let's see if he can go 76. Thank you very much there, James. That was James Busfield. That was Crimson Cat, owned by Jill Busfield. Side by Tap Dance and Cat, out of a Spins Jewel. Sixty-seven there for James. Sixty-seven. Also there, poorly on that judge sheet for Emmy Lou Everingham, which would have been LD Dream Time on there. It will be Doctor Phil, who she'll be showing. If you want to put that on there on your judge's sheet, Paul, if you haven't been corrected. Okay, as we move to, Molly's going to be next to go. Thank you very much to Black Truck and Ag, Parts and Service, Roma 4624-4800 for Azuzu, Western Star and Mandela. As we're going to move to the North Star Senior Youth Champion last weekend, Molly Hartog. With Aaron Rayel Slick, owned by the Christensen family. Side by Jewel Ray, out of an Aaron Park Slick Meg. Was bred by the Aaron Park stud. Was first and second last weekend. So let's watch her. Molly, number six on the draw, Aaron Rayel Slick.
Molly Hartog right there with Erin Rayel Slick, owned by the Christensen family. That one was side by Jewel Ray out of an Erin Park Slick Meg. Did leave working area before time, so it will be a zero. Next up we Boston Musgrave, and then we'll have Emmy Lou Everingham, then we'll have Molly once again, then Bree Arnell, JC Holmes, Riley Brown, and Rory Ainsworth will be our last competitor. And now you've heard that we're watching here today. Thank you very much to Hamilton Park Wagyu. Wagyu beef with exceptional level of marbling fertility and growth. www.hamiltonparkwagyu.com This will move to a Boston Musgraves. Number seven on the draw. This is Who's Midnight, owned by Ginger Lee Sapanen. Was side by Who's Top Cat out of a Oaks Midnight Dream. Was bred by Richard Bull. Our next across the show timeline. Here today in our youth division, we got the senior youth and the junior youth for buckles up for grabs. Thank you very much there, Boston. That was Boston Musgraves. That was Who's Midnight, owned by Ginger Lisa Pannon. That one was side by Who's Top Cat out of an Oaks Midnight Dream. Well, I'll tell you what, you're going to be excited, Boston. 76 to the lead, 76 in our senior youth, 76. Nice job there, Boston. So Colonel Mustard is a scratching. Sorry about that there, Lynn. I totally forgot about the gentleman come and told me that was a scratching. So we'll move to Emmy Lou Everingham. We'll be next to go, then Molly Hartog, then Bree Arnell, then JC Holmes. So that'll be your next four. Thank you very much to Santos, a proudly Australian company. Santos is a leading supplier of natural gas, a fuel for the future, providing clean energy to improve the lives of people in Australia and Asia. www.santos.com as we move to Emmy Lou Everingham. Number nine on the draw will be showing Dr. Phil, not LD Dreamtime, that is written on our draw sheet. 
will be Dr. Phil. This one owned by Andrew Richardson. Next one to go right here. So Dr. Phil's we'll be looking at. This one signed by Ebe's Polaris out of a Shania Niner. Was bred by Drew O'Keefe. So we've got the senior youth leader right now, Boston Musgraves, with 76. We've got 75, Rachel Brown, 73 with Kate Smith. In our junior youth so far, Mitchell Stabes leading it with the 69. So let's watch Emmy Lou Everingham. Just a boy in a broken toy, all lost and poor. So it's here I stand. As a boy. Thank you very much, Sir Emmy Lou. That was Emmy Lou Everingham. That one was Dr. Phil, owned by Andrew Richardson. That we got to see right there, Dr. Phil. That was signed by Ebe's Flaris out of a Shania Niner. 63 there for Emmy Lou. 63, 63 point marking. Next up will be Molly Hartog, and then we'll have Bree Arnell, JC Holmes, Riley Brown, then Rory Ainsworth. Also, thank you very much to the Fat Wag Gamery for sponsoring our barbecue night on Wednesday night. And also, Proactive Tax and Business Solutions Roma for sponsoring our pizza night on Tuesday night. Let's watch Molly Hartog with Georgina Style, the Wairima competitor. This one side by Pepto Stylish Oak out of a Hanks Georgie Girl. It was bred by Hood and Nolan. Let's watch Molly right now. We're 76 on top in our senior youth division. She'll have to go 77 for the lead.
Thank you very much there, Molly. That was Molly Hartog there, right there, with Georgina Style. That was side by Pepto Stylish Oak out of a Hanks Georgie Girl. Sixty-eight point marking there for Molly. Sixty-eight there for Molly. This is next up be Bree Arnell, and then we'll have JC Holmes and Riley Brown, then Rory Ainsworth to wind things down. Now you've heard here today. Thank you very much to Letterbuck Pro Services. Ask about the famous Mini Kids Bouncy Rodeo Show for your next agricultural show, festival or event. Inbox or Facebook on and call 0427281427. As we're going to move to Bree Arnell from St George, number 11 on the draw. This is A Little Red Colonel, owned by Paul and Kate Arnell. Side by the Little Red Rooster. Out of the Colonel's Destiny was bred by the Cutter Bar Quarter Horses. It was a 2021 Ballon River Cutters Futurity Show Junior Youth Champion for the show last September. Let's watch Bree Arnell. Thank you very much there, Bree. That was Bree Arnell from St. George. That was A Little Red Colonel, owned by Paul and Kate Arnell. That was side by the Little Red Rooster at a Colonel's Destiny. 66-point marking there for Bree. 66. This next up will be JC Holmes, and we'll have Riley Brown, then Rory Ainsworth. We'll wind down our youth herd. Also, our next event on the program will be our four-herd event. Of the 15,000 non pro, so the David Smith herd settling team to be on standby. Well, let's watch JC Holmes from Emerald, number 12 on the draw. This is Elmora Spin Acre, owned by the Smith and Holmes Family Trust. Side by Acres Destiny. And a bit of spin. And Destiny's bit of spin. 
no bit of spin. And then was bred by Jim Simpson, number 12 on the draw. Won some money at the Wild Horse Cutting last September. Was up in that top three in the youth. Let's watch her here today. One of our senior youth competitors, JC Holmes. Thank you very much there, JC. That was JC Holmes from Emerald, number 12 on the draw. That was L. Morris Spin Acre, owned by the Smith and Holmes Family Trust. That was by side by Acre's Destiny at a bit of spin. Well, nice job there for JC. 72 point marking, 72. So they'll put around a fourth right now in our senior youth. So we've got two more to go Riley Brown, then Rory Ainsworth. Then we'll have our presentation of our senior and our junior youth presentation. Thank you very much to Pack Horse for sponsoring all our non-pro buckles here this weekend at the Roma SQ CHA Cutting Show. Also Proactive Tax and Business Solutions, specialising in all things accounting, tax, bookkeeping and business with a particular focus on rural and agri small business clients. Well, let's watch Riley Brown from Thebine, number 13 on the door. This is Merry Little CD, owned by Jamie Brown. Side by Highbrow CD, out of a merry little dreamer, was bred by the Buckeridge family. He's a young man that's one of our top junior youth competitors. Very competitive young man. Let's see if he can challenge the lead right now, our junior. Now, junior right now, 69 is our high marking so far. Let's watch Riley Brown, merry little CD.
Thank you very much there, Riley. That was Riley Brown from Thebine. That was Merry Little CD owned by Jamie Brown. Side by Highbrow CD and a Merry Little Dreamer. 60 points there for Riley today. 6-0 there for Riley. Who's next up be Rory Ainsworth to wind things down. Now, youth here today, and it will be our last junior youth competitor, that side of things. Right now, holding on to that number one spot is Mitchell Stabe with 69 for our junior youth. It's Rory Ainsworth around the Booner area next to go. Thank you very much to Pack Horse. Also, Proactive Tax and Business Solutions. Find them on Facebook for more information. Let's watch Rory Ainsworth, number 14. This is Pretty Ju Boy Julie, owned by Julie Sheedy. This one side by Julie Cool out of an S Dale West Lethal Spin was bred by Rex and Julie Sheedy. Thank you very much there, Rory. That was Rory Ainsworth. That was Pretty Boy Julie, owned by Julie Sheedy. Side by Julie Cool out of an S. Dale West Lethal Spin. Well, you're going to like this, Rory. Last out, first time in the Junior Youth. 75 there for Rory. She's going to win the Junior Youth today. 75. Nice job. So 75 was 69 with Mitchell Stabe. Gets second in the Junior Youth today with Saloon Dancer, and then we've got 68 with Jade Lyons with the Spin Silver Revolver. And in our senior youth, our winner will be Boston Musgraves with 76, with Who's Midnight, then we'll go back to 75, Rachel Brown with I'm a Neat Cat, then 73 with Kate Smith. So if I have that next herd settling team on standby, the David Smith herd settling team, we'll be doing our presentations for our junior and senior youth. I'll just make sure We'll double check everything there down there with Paulie for a second.
So if we have the top three of each of the senior and the junior youth, please to come back in the arena. So our junior youth top three, Rory Ainsworth and Mitchell Stabe and Jade Lyons, please. And our senior youth, Boston Musgrave, Rachel Brown and Kate Smith, please. So we'll do our junior youth presentation first. So our junior youth, we've got to buckle up for grabs for our winner here today. For our top three in our junior youth. So first place today goes to Rory Ainsworth with 75, pretty boy Julie. Owned by Julie Sheedy, will be our champion here today. We'll receive a Bob Berg Designs buckle and the champion sash as well. Congratulations to Rory. Now, reserve champion today will go to Mitchell Stabe with 69 with Saloon Dancer. Great to see Mitchell get in there, reserve champion today. You'd be pretty happy, wouldn't you, Mitchell? Give us a thumbs up. <laughs> yeah, he's happy. And so we will crown our reserve champion today, Mitchell Staber. I know Mum's going to be happy down there, aren't you, Belinda? <laughs> Seems as though he's a little bit nervous at Chinchilla, and it's great to see the last few weeks he's really getting a lot more confidence. And our third place getter today, Jade Lyons with 68 with Spin Silver Revolver. Congratulations. We get our quick photo of our top three and our junior youth here today at the Roma SQCHA cutting show for 2022. Great to see some of the young up and comers showcasing here today on day number three here at Roma. Geez, you're not very good at kicking dirt up there, Brett. <laughs> A round of applause to our top three today there, ladies and gentlemen, and our junior youth, and congratulations to our champion, Rory Ainsworth. So we'll get a quick photo there of Rory, and then we can get our senior youth competitors ready. Boston Musgrave, Rachel Brown, and Kate Smith. So come on out there, our senior youth top three today. Here he is. Good to see Brett Peach. He's awake to this morning. Good on you, Brett. <laughs> did you sleep in, did you, my friend? No. <laughs> so our top three in our senior youth. Congratulations. We're just lining them up right there. We get a... So first place today will go to Boston Musgraves of Who's Midnight, owned by Ginger Lee Sapanum with 76, ladies and gentlemen. Round of applause there for Boston today. We'll receive a buckle for his efforts here today. I better strap that one in about two minutes' time. What do you think, Andrew? He'll strap it on straight away. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's already nodding his head already. <laughs> and our reserve champion today will go to Rachel Brown with 75 today, ladies and gentlemen. Nice job there for Rachel. That was with I'm an Eat Cat, owned by Jamie Brown. And third place today will be Kate Smith with Bohemia Rock, owned by Terry and Caroline Elliott with the 73. Congratulations to our top three and our senior youth today. A great job. So we get a quick photo of our top three today for senior youth. A round of applause once more for our senior youth champions today there, ladies and gentlemen. As we see our future stars of the sport of cunning. Our next event on the program is going to be our 15,000 non-pro. We've got four herds in total. So go and stretch your legs, go and grab yourself some food. Check out our wonderful traders on show as well. 
Got some food from the Baking Asylum. Also grab yourself a cold drink from Maddie's Espresso. And we'll be back very soon for our next event on the program, the 15,000 Non-Pro. Put your hands on your head.